Hey everybody, I am Professor Matt Broderick. I am going to be your instructor for English 101 this fall and just wanted to send out a quick video introducing you to the course and just providing some basic information that might be helpful um, in preparation for our first class next week. So the meeting space that we're going to use for this fall is Zoom. Everybody should be able to access Zoom. I put in um, a how-to set up Zoom through Rutgers um, link and also a link to the personal classroom that all three sections of mine will use during the semester. Um, the password should be really easy too for the Zoom classroom. It's just going to be 101 101. Um, this PowerPoint that I am presenting right now, I'll also post that to Blackboard, which everybody should be able to access. But um, make sure you can and just send me an email after this if there's any issues. But I'll post this lecture on Blackboard along with plenty of other materials that I go over throughout the semester. So you'll always be able to access those after any lecture that I give. Uh, for our first class next week, uh, we'll be doing a diagnostic essay. So all 101 classes are required to complete a diagnostic essay as the first or second class of the semester. I like to do it on the first just so we can get it out of the way. Basically show up during the um, assigned period for our class uh, through Zoom. I will give you guys about five minutes to get settled and then I'll send out a short reading and essay prompt through Blackboard for you to read and then write a, it doesn't have to be super long, but <clears throat> couple paragraph response, essay response to the prompt that I provide. Um, I'll go over this again, but I'm hoping that everybody can do that in Microsoft Word and convert those to PDF before sending them back to me. Um, that way it just makes it easier for me to <clears throat> mark those up <clears throat> because if I have them on PDF, I can do, um, do some corrections on my iPad. So I'll reiterate that next week, but if you haven't downloaded the Microsoft Office products yet, you can do so for free through this link um, through Rutgers. And here's also a guide in converting Word documents to PDFs if you're not exactly sure on how to do that. Um, I mentioned it before, but Blackboard is sort of our hub. It's where I will post all updates. I'll post um, <clears throat> our syllabus, our reading schedule pretty shortly. And that's going to be kind of like where you're going to go to get all the materials for our class or any previous lectures that I may have done. I'll post them on there. Um, make sure you can access Blackboard. Um, familiar, familiarize yourself with the site if you can. Like I said, I'll put the syllabus up there, our reading schedule, and the updates and learning materials that we go over. And then we'll also probably use Blackboard for some what I call small stakes assignments, just things we do in class or discussion boards that I have you do outside of class in regards to the readings. Uh, let's see. So for the semester, we're going to be using... Um, well, primarily we'll be using one textbook. We're going to be using Emerging Contemporary Readings for Writers, the third edition. So there is a fourth edition, but I don't see a need in you guys spending a ton of money for something that we can just use an older version of and it still be perfectly fine. Um, so make sure you get the third edition. This is the cover for it. And also we'll be using for um, different grammar lessons, this pocket style manual. Um, this is also, there's also a newer edition of this, but eighth edition is fine. Um, that's the one I'll primarily be referencing. So I would say the pocket style manual eighth edition is perfectly fine. And there's also links here for those if you want to go directly to the Amazon site to purchase them. Outside of that, I don't have much else. Um, again, just wanted to say hi and welcome you to the semester. If you guys have any concerns or questions about the class, 
um, please feel free to reach out to me. Um, this extends for the entire semester. I'm always going to be available. So always make sure that you're reaching out with any questions or concerns, or if you wanted to set up a meeting with me at some point, we can do a face-to-face -face through Zoom or FaceTime or whatever. But basically, my email is mjb559 at rutgers.edu. And outside of that, enjoy this last weekend of summer break. Hopefully the weather holds up and I will see you guys next week.